everyone welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to cover the second year roadmap for getting a tech job or whatever so if you're in college if you're in your second year then what all things you need to do you you can watch this video i've made a first year roadmap video obviously these roadmaps are not concrete because i always give you advice to learn and explore and find your own path but i'm going to be sharing my experiences because this is one of the most requested videos in our community so uh, in this video i'm going to share with you two approaches so one approach that i'll share with you is obviously second year roadmap given that you have followed the first year roadmap and the second part of this video would be for people who are in their second year of college who have done nothing in their first year okay so i'll share it with them as well because that's also a, a lot requested and uh, there are many such videos on youtube regarding this so as i always say before watching this any uh, any such roadmap video including this one uh, go check out the linkedin profile of the person who is making that video what they themselves did in their second year because this is a very popular clickbait topic and i don't want you to fall for clickbaits so you can go check out my linkedin as well if you feel like kunal did nothing in his second year and he is making a video on second year roadmap then you don't have to watch this video so that way you would be safe from clickbaits and you will not fall for scams when you always look for proof so let's get started so what is the first thing you need to do first thing you need to do is if you not if you have not watched the first year roadmap video go check it out highly recommend you to do that you can find the link in the description below okay now let's talk about the theme of second year what is the theme of second year so this is like for bca b tech or whatever you want to call it okay and i'm talking about tech jobs so the theme of second year is gaining experiences doing some more deep dives on things you have already learned in first year and preparing for your internships because there are two types like of when you do internships one is the big tech company um, like google facebook and all these other companies so they have their specific time duration so by december or something google has already like selected all the interns and and whatever for the next year okay so if you want to apply for internship in like when you will if you want to do an internship in like around third year you would have to apply at the end of second year around somewhere okay so theme of second year is preparing for internships so how do we do this and the second part of the internships is obviously uh, remote startups or normal startups startups in india or your own country um, they don't have like a specific period not most of them they hire whenever they want okay so that's the theme of second year and now let's talk about what to do so if you have followed the first year roadmap this is what you need to do in second year whatever things you have learned you would have identified it already like what you are interested in do deep dives in that contribute to open source take part in open source initiatives and uh, gain experiences um, study a little bit more like do a deep dives um, take part in hackathons make projects contribute to open source do a lot of hands on stuff okay don't worry about certifications as a student you don't have to worry about it no need okay so that's one thing second thing is gain experiences and share your knowledge give back this is looked at as a very valuable thing when it comes to students so um, you can make your own youtube channel where you can teach people you can write blogs submit cfps call for proposals at conferences okay uh, local meetups uh, student programs student specific meetups go give talks they will public speaking will be enhanced and you will meet a lot of nice people okay so give back experiences deep dive these are the things we mentioned okay second year you don't have to do any internship you can just contribute to open source or do your own thing or whatever but if you're getting an internship a legit internship go for it legit internships are already covered what they are if you have not seen already check out my the previous videos on my channel but internships where you get to learn something that are providing you a stipend as well and where you're getting to explore and it's a good company or startup or whatever uh, many big tech companies have their own step intern program like google has a step intern program you can apply to that if you get into it um, it's very easy the interview is very easy it's like very basic stuff they ask okay because they know that you are in second year so the, obviously the interview is not that difficult you can do it just lead code easy to medium questions okay so that's about it but don't be desperate for an internship in your second year focus on building your profile and resume how i've already mentioned that okay 
now since you will be applying to internships in your like we will be preparing for internships in third year what do we need to do for that two things dsa study obviously uh, regularly practice data analysis algorithms lead code uh, you know give uh, timed tests on lead code company wise questions you can do lead code is more than enough i did a video with my friend who uh, you know who got a job at like bloomberg in london uh, amazon in 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 ireland or whatever um me as well i've gotten offers around the world so lead code is more than enough when it comes to clearing your coding rounds do not waste time in compare programming if you are preparing for your interviews or jobs so study part done um the next part is uh, so i'm i'm trying to make you an all rounder okay um so the next thing is profile and your resume so do a little bit of development make projects you know all the things in public and going to hackathons having a good github profile connections being active around the world com in, in communities around the world going to events speaking at conferences and things like that or local meetups and being part of community communities basically so all these other things okay cool most people ask me kunal what is the you know what is the um kunal what is the um, best way to get involved in communities or whatever i made a video on that already uh, the communities that i'm a part of or whatever and the way i look at these things so you can do that okay so you talked about preparing for internships talked about profile resume study the theme of second year uh, you don't have to be desperate for an internship in second year experiences deep dives give back when you do deep dive it will set you for your future years and things like that that is basically about it and when you explore these things when you get involved in these communities or whatever many more things that are not mentioned in this video will be uh, visible to you and you will yourself explore okay cool now the second part of this video is for people who have done nothing in first year and are in their second year okay first of all watch my data science algorithms playlist dsa is important that playlist will help you clearing any like coding interview round practice lead code and all the tips that i have given you okay so your lead code part and coding interview part is now sorted you have to work hard on that second thing is gets give some time to development and open source and all these other things that i mentioned building a profile second year if you are starting coding in second year it's not too late don't worry just have to work a little bit harder okay it's nothing nothing much different than what i just mentioned for people who have already done whatever i've mentioned in the first year part so all the only new thing is you would be doing data just from scratch and you can just start with some development like web dev or whatever and you can do open source and you can try out various things and uh, obviously you won't have time to try out a lot of things right the time is limited but you can do all the main main things like you can try web development and devops and things like that or just if you have time you can find time uh, you know and and try out more things if you want it all depends on how much time you have and how much will willingness you have to give so don't one more thing i recommend is don't worry about don't worry about how much time you have lost okay because that time is gone you can't do anything about it first year you didn't do anything that's okay you can't do anything about it now what matters is what you do today so in short if you didn't do anything in your first year and you are in your second year please study and learn in public build your profile build your resume work hard okay don't waste time and if you are after second year third year fourth year pass out or whatever subscribe to my youtube channel i make another video on that soon that is about it thanks a lot for watching good luck you can do this and uh, make sure like and subscribe if you have any comments leave those on comment section below i'll see you in the next one have a great day